everybody. Ryan McCaffrey with IGN, joined by the one and only Mr. Andrew Goldfarb. How's it going, Ryan? Going well because we've got ourselves a new Grand Theft Auto V trailer. This game is less so than three close. weeks away. Yeah, Actually, it, I think it's three weeks. No, not even three weeks. It is so close. Yeah, this is probably the final trailer we'll see, we have to imagine. I would think so. Uh, they finally revealed GTA Online. So yeah, this is sort of the last one minute. Let's uh, let's just do some whiz-bang stuff, show them what's, uh, what this game is capable of and get everybody hyped up one last time. And so uh, we're rolling through it here, but there's, there's actually plenty to pick out because there's a lot of quick cuts, a lot of quick scenes, things to check out. So let's start by uh, backing up to the beginning. Now, of course, we're here in the desert. Again, this, we've seen the desert before, but just the, the scale of this game yeah. continues to blow my mind every single time we see something about it. It's true, and you know, unlike other games, like yeah, like a lot of next gen games, especially are showing off these big environments. But the the interesting thing here is like you know you'll be able to go to all of these places, and yeah, that's what's so exactly. incredible about GTA. And so here in this scene, we have uh, Trevor Michael and Franklin. There's uh, here we're at Michael's house now. Right here, we'll stop right here. Blaine County Savings Bank. Uh, Blaine County is one of the, I'm almost sure it's one of the outskirt counties. It's not sure. downtown Los Santos, because obviously it would be Los Santos Savings Bank. <laughs> but also, if you just roll a little forward, you can see the huge mountain over there on the side. So clearly we are outside of of Los Santos proper. And yeah, you have to assume this is like one of the big heists you'll be doing. I mean, that, that kind of seems like a, I would have to assume the, the mission structure will be each one is kind of a big heist that you prepare for and then execute. Yeah, especially because um, they've they've talked about how the whole game is a series of little missions building up to the heist and then the heist themselves. And here, if, actually, if we just go back a little bit one more time, we can see that they have uh, masks, backpacks. They are storming in. Yeah, and I think so, you get a better shot of that in a second too. But yeah, yeah they are they are they mean business with these heists. So, I love how every time you see Trevor, he's just in like these like <laughs> crappy like trailer park style places. And uh, I think it was you who pointed out the back says, uh, "Buy piss water; it makes her pretty again." <laughs> piss wasser. Piss that wasser. Is, of course, the beer me. that was introduced to us in previous <laughs> GTA games. But yeah, it makes her pretty again. It's such so a good. such a GTA thing to say for sure. Um, and let's take a look. Remember this guy. We've seen this guy on the right in other trailers mm -hmm. right here. He is, uh, but we remember he was wearing like kiss makeup. Yeah, he, he was uh, dressed as a juggalo, I believe. Yes, yeah. and we speculated that maybe he was Michael's son, but we're still not sure. I mean, I doubt it because he's here hanging with Trevor. Right, he's probably he runs in similar circles. You have to assume there will be all kinds of crazy crossover and everything. Yeah. Um, All right, now now this is what you were talking about a yep. second ago. And you have to assume, like, so, again, this is this seems to be the actual a continuation of the shot we saw before. This is probably in the Blaine County Savings Bank, uh, a, hike, a heist actually in action. And, you know, shooting out the cameras and stuff like that, I, I'm assuming will be, like, mission objectives. You'll have to do those things. Well, or optional ones, at least. If you don't do it, maybe you get more heat on it's you, harder, like a higher yeah. wanted level. Sure. Yeah, we can see here, there's some... Uh, so trying to get to look at that gun. You look at that. Those are some pretty yeah. high-powered weapons. You can see all three of the uh, almost maybe M16 looking gun at the top there. Very classy um, wearing suits too. I wonder I wonder <laughs> how often Trevor busts out his suit. That's true. <laughs> that's true. And then uh yeah, that and remember we know that you could you can mod weapons in yeah. GTA 5. Which so. is crazy. Like again, like just the 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 scope of this game and the amount of customization, it's like uh, kind of overwhelming. Yeah, breaking in straight into the vault here, which is obviously the goal. This is a great scene, if only for what's going on in the background. Yeah, I love the toys. Captain Space Toy, Brown Streak. Uh, I like all these things. You point out something interesting about Brown Streak, actually. Yeah, I remember. I'm like, Brown Streak, that was... That was actually the, a joke they used. That was the railroad in San Andreas. <laughs> like if you went out into the into the countryside, and the train would go by, you see it was Brown Streak Railroad. <laughs> so I guess it's been it's been uh, reappropriated as a as a superhero and an action figure, which is actually funnier. Quite yeah, frankly. for sure. And then a little noob sticker at the bottom of the wall yeah. there. And this guy we'll see some more of in a minute. I, I yeah. kind of love that he's sort of this the stereotypical like because uh, you know Rockstar always likes to play with tropes like it you know kind of combine all the different movies together. And this is obviously kind of their surveillance tech hacker. Yeah, dude. this guy's been in like every movie ever. What was it? <laughs> Wasn't it uh, in the the crappy Die Hard? Not the most recent one. Uh, Die Hard Four. It was yes. Jack Black. Was that who played? I believe the? so. Yeah. Or no, I was, <laughs> it, was it? Was it Kevin Smith? It was Kevin Smith. That's right. Yeah. That's right. You are correct, sir. More Trevor. I, lo I like seeing him and Michael fight because, you know, yeah. they obviously come from uh, very different places. And let's let's back up. 
this is just again every single scene they've shown us has been stunning. Yeah. It first of all, look at the draw distance back yeah. there. Even with the um the the you know, Los Angeles smog layer there and again it's not artificial like no. you'll go there you you'll, you'll go, go there. to those buildings you, you see the helicopter in the distance like you could be flying that helicopter yep. like god the scope of gta it's like in, as we get so much closer i just i forget how fun and huge these games are and looks there's a camper there in the foreground on the left behind mm-hmm. the vinewood sign um a little stream and then over on the right check it out there's a reservoir over mm-hmm. there so that's yet another place you can go there i'm yeah. sure there will be a mission there maybe you'll be throwing <laughs> Destroy the dam or or something. Yeah, who knows? All right, let's see. All right, so, okay. And and I don't think we really know who the, I mean, you know, obviously we know Michael Trevor Franklin. Yeah, Michael on the right. That may be, uh, it's tough to tell if that's Franklin seated on the couch. Yeah, I don't. I don't think we know a, a, the bulk of these guys. You would assume these are kind of the people they recruit, kind of the up to no good henchmen that they yeah. kind of recruit to help them but, out on these missions. Yeah, obviously a heist being planned here. If you look at that bulletin board, mm-hmm. you see what's doing. Oof. I wonder how many animations they're going to have for, for, car, for yeah. carjacking this time. Man, I love seeing the rain effects and just seeing like the the dark city street. Uh, like now, this. I mean, this yeah. is just that. Look at that. Yeah. Let's go. Right. Look at that. That's awesome. Yeah, for sure. And I mean, this will be, again, kind of typical GTA thing. Obviously, you still maintain the, the, the usual mechanics. I'm sure, you know, five star wanted level running from the cops. Right. Like, all things you can expect in GTA games. Now, here's a better look. I wonder if this is this. This might be that same exact scene we were looking at a second ago, because um, that does look like. I think that's Franklin there sitting on the couch in the same position. Right. And you've got kind of the blueprints in the background. Ago. Yeah. Our, the- our hacker surveillance friend. On the right. That's actually a job. I love this. You point out, it, it, it looks like something from like a James Cameron it's, movie. It's the South Park episode where James Cameron tries, goes down to, to try and raise the bar for society. <laughs> yeah, I do. I love the idea of just uh, submarines and all, just the vehicle variety is kind of unreal. But there's a submarine in GTA. We already knew yeah. there was underwater stuff, but there is a sub. A sub. God, I mean, I we did wait. see, to be fair, we did see a sub. Um, when we broke down, when me, Greg, and Damon broke down the GTA Online trailer, there was this, you could see the subsurface there, but this, you get a really, really good look at it. As For sure. Trevor goes insane. Um, I, again, Trevor and Michael fighting, obviously, uh, you know, they're, they have a very uh, volatile relationship, it would seem. Yeah, I'm guessing that's loot, because it's being, it's in a suitcase, and Michael's dressed up. He's clearly been doing some sort of crazy, maybe base jumping type yeah. activity. Sure. Uh, they're out in they're out in Trevor Land here, out in the <laughs> sticks. Uh, and so, yeah, so they're both uh, again on the job and high tech tools, man. Like they're they're not. It's not like they're doing this with duct tape. Like they're they're really hardcore. Yeah. And they here some is uh, Amanda, which is Michael's ah. wife, who we've seen her doing yoga in mm-hmm. previous trailers, and she clearly hates him. And you look here, you know, again, kind of getting a better idea of the story. Like, obviously, the amount of time that he's putting into these heists is affecting his home life. Yeah. Even though he was supposedly retired. Let's go right. Let me see if we can just advance this. Oh, not that far right. Man. So just, again. Like that shot of the city as you're jumping out. Yeah. Look at that. I mean, that's you can go to every single one of those places. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty insane. I, I like the day-night cycles, too. I think it definitely oh, makes it feel uh, yeah. a little more yeah, I'm intense. just trying to go frame it up a little bit better here. I think you can see the Vinewood sign here in a second. Right there. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. So, and yeah, is that, really I wonder, big. the big mountain, is that Mount Chiliad in the background? Could be. That's We know that's the big mountain that's returning from San Andreas. I love the mini gun. Oh. Like, the guns are insane. Terminator 2 style. Yeah. Just tear it up. Oh. I want to shoot a helicopter with that gun. <laughs> I want to ride the helicopter <laughs> and shoot at the guy with the gun. There's the, by the way, big mountain in the background here. This appears to be, this. I wonder if this is the same mountain we saw at the beginning of the trailer in mm-hmm. front of the Blaine County Savings Bank. You would guess that this is all same from town. early in the game. I don't think they yeah. want to show too much off yet, probably. Yeah. So I would guess these are all kind of revolving around the same early mission. Uh, you point out something crazy here yeah, uh, as well, he approaches the camera. Besides, again, the spectacular sunset car chase. And just the scope right. of how many people are chasing yeah. him. Right. A uh, little farther. So close. Little, uh. There you go. There. Yeah, the damage on his bike. I Damage I, on the bike. That's really, really cool. I, I like the idea the of that being dynamic. The, again, the detail is astounding. Yep. For, this is a current generation game. This is being done on eight-year-old hardware. Yep. 
it's kind of cool interior of the building. It's a, you said, it I, looks I agree like an with elevator, you. Shaft, elevator shaft, right? Yeah. Yep. And we're repelling in or out, I guess out, considering it's exploding. <laughs> yeah, hopefully out, <laughs> unless this is the final mission of the game. Uh, again, our, again, our hacker friend. You know, it, it seems like maybe he'll be, obviously, this is a serious kind of trying to tell this high story, but at the same time, there will be obviously comic relief in classic GTA fashion. Yeah. Oh, God, that's that going to be good. good. Yeah. And this is crazy too. Like I mean, because again, like they showed in the GTA Online trailer, like that seems like a cool set piece, like a cool cinematic moment. But you can probably do that. You can probably just carpet bomb a, a bridge like yeah, that. Yeah. Why not? I mean, we've seen the fighter jet in other trailers for yeah. the game. We know it's in there. It's and really just cool. fly them. Up. Boom! There you go. September seventeenth. It's getting so close. It really is. Uh, we're gonna have as much on Grand Theft Auto Five as we possibly can here, uh, leading up to to the game's release. And so uh, until then, Mr. Goldfarb, for all things Grand Theft Auto V, they're already in the right place, which would be IGN.com. Correct. Psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere. Nobody